I am on my New Balance grind. Newbie season. And y'all know that I love I'm on my year and social status. So this one was fitting. I put it into work. Time to review it to you jerks. For you jerks. You peoples out there. Like and subscribe. Check me out on all social media platforms. But let's hop into the review of this nice clean shoe. Yeeny. Now, this could be called, or initially we call it social status, but it's technically the Whitaker Group, which oversees APB, Ama Manier, and social status. Today we got a 1906, and not an R, but a U. Excuse me, the U stands for utility, which makes you know that it's, uh, it has all the bells and whistles to keep everything good to go for a long time. That's what I think of when I think of utility, outside of paying my electric bill when I'm uh, doing videos in the crib. No, I'm talking about. Regular New Balance box right here. It's very simple. There's nothing really to tell you about it or talk to you about the box. The box is mad simple, New Balance wise. Um, 1906, this one doesn't even have a U on it. Size 13, Big Feet Big Gang, Gang Salute. 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 You know how I do. Classic traditionalities, I don't even need to read that. Gray, gray, gris, gris. Like I said, they don't even tell you the full colors on the box. But I like these, brother. These right here. I almost want to call them a banger schnitzel. A banger schnitzel. Yeah, these are like that, yo. Um, at least in terms of me and like my new love for new balances. It took a while. It took a long time. Opening up this box, you agree with regular new balance paper. I didn't even know which one I was going to review because it's a pack that came from the Whitaker Group. And uh, I'm gonna show you both with two different reviews because that's how much money I spent for the shoes. It deserves its own reviews. No versus today. As you can see right here, I should have showed you the paper, but it was just basic paper. So I went straight to the shoe. This is the electric teal pair. Is that the color for this one? They gave them two random names for the colors, but really, the shoe is going to speak for itself and I'm talking about. In front of me you have the 1906 U in the electric teal colorway. Two colors came out July 17th at a price point of 170 bucks. I've had these sitting here for a minute and just got the reveal, but I had so many shoes come in that I guess I just forgot about them maybe, which is crazy because I really liked them when they first dropped. The 1906, whether it's the R or the U, as well as the 2002 R, are probably the most the two most popular New Balances right now. I wanted the 1906 and I waited for a brand that I like to drop one, essentially. Willful bias, once you look, I'm not, I'm not jumping the gun, but I will, I will say, willful bias, if you look at the insoles both together, it shows you like lady luck, like checking underneath for a little handkerchief and like doing a peek. Because it's, you know, their whole branding is about social injustice or justice and people of color and whatnot. And um, this was just saying, hey, it's kind of who you know, who you know type game. And a lot of times people look the other way when um, people of color are having injustices done to them, as well as other people may get a easy ride or ticket into the game because of who they know or their skin color. Um, and this time Lady Luck's not looking away. That's essentially what it was. I think I wore that right, even though it took a while to get there. You know, I do little notes, but I just, uh, off the top of the cup, I just wanted to do it, right? But um, yeah, so the insoles is dope, obviously. A lot of times people don't show the insoles, or it's hard to take them out, so we just, uh, well, this one you can take out easier, actually. So she's looking there, and then I don't want to get the other one off the box, but um, yeah, she's, she's uh, checking. Let's talk about the rest of the materials, though, because uh, maybe that was long-winded. I don't think it was. I just wanted to be informative because you came for the review. And uh, was it hard to get the insole back in here? This is why I don't take insoles out. Yeah, that's so annoying. Bear with me. All right, I'm back. So yeah, starting over the top of your shoe because this is the utility version, you have a bunch of materials on this shoe. The white mesh that you see right there, the white that you see right there, if you will, is mesh. After that, it's hard to, like, 
There's different textures. There's some leathers. There's some cuts of new buck. The silver right here looks reflective. It kind of shines bright like a diamond Rihanna voice. But it's all over the shoe. Silver, grays, lighter grays. You can obviously see this inlock New Balance right there. I believe that's 3M. I'm gonna go ahead and say it is, but it just may not be. And it's a gray outline in with New Balance or the rest of the end being teal. This is an electric teal pair. I apologize for the ambulance if you can't hear that. And if you can't, let's just keep it moving. Let's just keep it a buck. Hang towards the back of your shoe. On your lateral side, you will see 1906 R written right there in white, but it's surrounded by all that silver and gray, so it might be a little hard to see it. This shoe definitely has a little bit of orange right there on the back of the heel. And you can also see New Balance written right there in more teal. You have energy for the midsole here, which is their cushioning to make sure that you can uh, deal with shock absorption and whatnot. The 1906 typically is a running shoe, so I guess you can run in this, even though this is the utility pair. So if you wanna run in it, go ahead. But yeah, it's really just a stylistic dad, comfortable leisure shoe or whatever, you know, all that. Darker grays for your midsole as well as some orange to pop up front. And then obviously as you head towards your outsole, you have more of these, um, it's got, it looks like a runner's lover shoe, but like I said, this is more, um, I'm not gonna run it. I'm gonna wear it to, you know, throw on some sweats or a pair of jeans and go run some errands and go shopping and go to a birthday party. I don't even know, yo. I, it just caught my eye, yo, and I like a lot of stuff that they do, so that's why I have this pair. Blue laces, if you don't want the blue laces, you can obviously see this pair has the teal laces right there. The sock liner is also teal. It just lets it pop a little more on top of this more subtle or neutral colors with the whites and the light green, the dark gray. True to size, so if you wear a 13, go get a 13. If you wear a nine or five, go get a nine or five. Wear this all day long to work, nine to five. Yeah, retail was 170 bucks. This colorway is kind of going for under retail. So you can probably go get these for a steal. A lot of new balances, at least the ones that have been catching my eye, have been like 220, 230, 240. So uh, a pair of these newbies for like 140 is not too shabby. I don't know if this is my favorite color of the two, but I do like the color and I like the story maybe more than the color to be honest, but I do like the color obviously. If you ask me a grade for these, I'm probably gonna go with like a seven. It's not the greatest new balance, but it caught my eye and I think it's worthy of having. Um, and I'm glad I got a pair of 1906 R's. Um, I can't give every single shoe high super ranks. There's nothing wrong with you. We're just gonna stay with a seven today because these random numbers that I throw out are just random sometimes. So I'm gonna give this a much higher color, especially if they're like, me and my friends nickname these the Dolphins. This is like a Tua, Waddle, Tyreek Hill jersey. Boom. Let me know in the comments below if you bang with this one. If you like the colors here, if you wish it was a little more subtle, because for real, it is subtle, minus the teal. So if you say that, I'll be like, oh, okay, you really like it basic. But um, this is a little different than a regular New Balance. It's typically all gray, but just only a little bit more. Or different. Tiny, itsy bitsy, witsy bitsy, itsy kitsy kitsy. Until the next video, I'm gonna holla at you. Bye bye. But I bang with it, social status. You know, I just cop your two threes from you know, the other brand that you or the Whitaker group, your threes from social status, whatever. Bye bye. And you know, I'm just copying everything y'all got, you know? Waiting for your fours. You know, I got a bunch of it behind me. Where's the fives at? There's the Air Maxes or the Penny one. I have all your stuff, you know, basically. Y'all take my money all the time.